Welcome to this new video from Animal Wise. Today we're going to talk about the miniature pincher, sometimes known as the mini pin, the little dog with a huge personality. This incredible breed originates from Germany and is the result of crossing German pinchers, Italian greyhounds and the Dachshund. Due to their similarity in appearance, many people believe that mini pins are close relatives to the Doberman. But this is a false myth. The two breeds do share some ancestry, however, the miniature pincher existed long before the Doberman. The miniature pincher is a small, compact dog with a square profile. They measure between 25 and 30 centimeters, 10 and 12 inches at shoulder height, and usually weigh somewhere between 4 and 6 kilograms, which is about 9 and 13 pounds. Their fur is short, dense and bright, it can be of a single block colour or some variation of black and tan. Miniature pinchers are very dynamic, curious and intrepid dogs. Despite their small size, they have a great temperament and a very distinguished character. They tend to become very attached to their closest relatives and somewhat reserved with strangers. It's important to remember, the socialisation of the dog will depend largely on its individual character. The miniature pincher is a very active and lively dog, perfect for equally dynamic families who are eager to offer their pet lots of attention and experience. Miniature pinchers are easy to take care of. Their coat only needs brushed once a week and only bathed when necessary. However, exercise is important and walking on a daily basis is essential. Different games and activities are also important to keep him physically and mentally stimulated. We can help to do this with intelligent games and special toys, as well as taking them out to new places and provide new experiences. They require at least two or three trips outside a day. To ensure a miniature pincher is both sociable and mentally healthy, you must socialise them at an early age. This means with people, other animals and objects. This is imperative if you want them to be a steady and healthy dog into their adulthood, especially when interacting with others. Adequate socialisation will also help lessen the likelihood of behavioural problems in the future. Training should be carried out using positive reinforcement and avoiding physical punishment. We need to teach them basic commands early on and review them regularly to ensure their effectiveness. They need to be mentally stimulated so we can better communicate with them. Also, even though they're small, they can attack you if you don't raise them properly. This is especially concerning if you have a family with young children. Miniature pinchers tend to be healthy dogs, although they are a breed sometimes prone to progressive retinal atrophy or patellar dislocation. More importantly, their diet needs to be monitored as they can have a tendency towards obesity. To ensure they stay healthy and we are able to detect any appearance of disease promptly, we need to take them to the vet every 6 to 12 months. Following vaccination and deworming schedules is important and they need to be adhered to strictly as a basic standard of care. And this is our video for today. If you enjoyed it, please like and subscribe to our channel. Don't forget to leave a comment with your requests for future Animal Wise videos, and take care until next time.